I finally got to IBC, the International Broadcast Conference in Amsterdam in the Netherlands. And this is 2022. And we got to see so much cool live streaming and video production technology that I'm gonna show you guys right after this. So if you're watching this video, you're probably interested in the latest trends for the broadcast and live streaming industry. IBC is always a great place to check out the latest gear, software, and people who are quite honestly helping to push the broadcast and streaming industry forward. This year, everyone seems to be taking a look at products and solutions through a new lens. IBC is a place where so many people from different backgrounds arrive, rethinking what's possible with today's video production cameras, IP-connected devices, cloud-based video production workflows, and so much more. Let me show you a little footage from the PTZ Optics booth that we set up at the Grass Valley Hall this year. Hi everybody, welcome to IBC 2022. I'm hoping you guys can see us, we're coming in clear. We're, I'm gonna start you guys off at the Grass Valley booth. Thanks Tess for hosting this live stream and Mike for switching and Lindsay for being there. You guys are doing a great job. IBC is so cool, we're here in Amsterdam. And I'm gonna start by showing you our Grass Valley booth here, the, our spot in the Grass Valley booth, and then I'll take you over to our booth to show you some of our new cameras. So our latest new camera is the Studio Pro. Now this is a really interesting camera. It comes with a light, as you can see, with a color temperature change. You can see the video right here. Where basically this camera has really high quality optics and an advanced focusing technology. So as you get really close to the camera, I don't know if you can see here, it's very, very crisp and sharp. So it's a great premium webcam. So if you wanna upgrade your webcam for those Zoom video conference calls, this is a great camera, but it's also great for streamers. So anyone doing live streaming that really cares about production, maybe you're doing live streaming of uh, e-commerce and you're selling something on Amazon Live, you need a camera that's super high quality that can also zoom in and focus very quickly. So it has a 12X optical zoom. Let's take a look at the back of the camera here so we can look at the connection ports. Uh, right now we're just showing HDMI, so you can just plug it right into a monitor. But it also has USB-C, which can power the camera and the light. Uh, so you can plug and play right near your computer via USB. It also supports NDI. And that's really important because NDI allows us to open up a whole bunch of IP video production systems, in, all the way up to working with Grass Valley, one of the world's most premier video production broadcast technology companies. So we're really excited to be here with Grass Valley. But literally this camera starts at only $699. So it's very affordable for anyone using OBS, vmix wirecast it will work with all of our current plugins and integrations meaning that it'll work with obs for uh, zoom control it will work with our ios and android applications and it will work with all of the ptz optics software that we have so now let's look at our brand new I'm really excited about this 4k ptz cameras now i'm going to show you guys these at the actual ptz optics booth but this is the PTZ Optics Move 4K. So it's a 4K PTZ camera, which is shipping soon. It is not shipping yet. We're just announcing this camera at IBC. And when it does ship, it will be available in 12X, 20X, and 30X lenses, just like our current second generation cameras. It'll be available in gray and white. So this is a really great 4K camera. It has IP connectivity for NDI, it has HDMI, it has SDI, and it has USB. So this has everything. It's our Swiss Army Knife camera that everybody knows and loves. Now it's available in 4K. I also got a chance to check out the X-Keys booth where I visited Maggie and got an in-depth update on the central control software from Joe to Max. Let's take a quick look and then I'm gonna post the full video tomorrow. All right, I'm gonna to try to explain what Joey has created here and then we'll let, we'll let Joe kind of take it over. 
Cool. Um, but come on over here. So this is called Central Control Elite. And what this software allows you to do is connect a whole bunch of devices and some interesting ones Joe is telling me about, obviously vMix, but also vMix in the cloud if you're running it with AWS. Yeah. Um, I also see we're using the ATEM Mini here. So a whole lot of products. We have a PTZ Optics NDI camera here that's connected to the network we're gonna show. And then you, okay, so that's the software part. I'm just gonna break this down. That's the software part of it. Then there's the hardware part of it. And the hardware part is the X keys. So this is 124? 124 T-bar, right, yeah. This one actually has a joystick that we're gonna look at. And it's all of this control is just coming out right here. So this is basically the output of the ATEM Mini. That's right. So Joey, why don't you show them what you can control? Yeah, so at the show today, we've got the ATEM Mini Extreme. It's a great switcher. But I myself as a TD don't really enjoy punching on it. So we've brought in this X keys 124 T-bar that really allows us to really expose the, the real functionality in the switcher. And I won't spend too much time on this, but I've got proper preview program row. I've got buttons for my look, different super source looks. And that's that's really what that's doing. But equally, this could be a vMix, this could be an Ata, a uh, TriCaster, or it could be multiple devices on one panel. So we could have this rose dedicated to vMix, this one's the ATEM, this one's doing something else really just allows me to connect anything to anything and map the buttons in a really flexible, easy way. User-defined control, shall we say. That's it for day one. We got to see some really cool control software from our friends over at Central Control. You guys got to see a little behind the scenes of brand new PTZ Optics cameras. And then you got to see some scenes from around IBC. Tomorrow, I'm gonna take a closer look at the Grass Valley booth and the Black Magic booths. And of course, I'm gonna spend a little bit more time with vMix. You got to see me steal the mouse pads in the last video. Uh, it's just always fun. There's I'm taking one about. We'll get one to the lab tomorrow a lot of great little uh, places to go and people to meet at IBC. So all the old friends from NAB are here. And uh, comment below if there's a company that you'd like us to check out in these videos while we're still here this weekend in Amsterdam.